The following is a special sports presentation of the Alaska Television Network. We got LaFrock, we got McEnany, and we got Hilder. LaFrock centering pass, score! It's another ATVN sports presentation. That's a little history there, Orwell. That's the first time you've ever seen anything like that live from the trail as it occurs, my friend. Slam jam bam, yes sir, good night. It's history. Chemo 13. Alaska's sports leader presents. Once may be enough for today's runners as well. A downtown start through the city streets to the base of the mountain. It's here in the chute where the real work begins. Positioning is now the key. While most choose the traditional route following the chute, others will skirt the ice and snow and will tackle the mountain head on. A maze of trails awaits the runners at this point, but ultimately, there's only one path that will take them to the top. The Mount Marathon is just over four miles long, but ask any participant, this may just be the toughest four miles in the world. Runners scratch, claw, and pull their way up the mountain, leaving the tree line behind to face the trail of shale and rock that lies ahead. Their goal, the 3,022-foot summit and turning rock. This marks the end of their climb and the beginning of their mad dash back down towards the finish line. At times almost out of control, runners negotiate the trail at whirlwind speeds where one slip could spell disaster. Runners now enter round two with the chute. This field of ice and snow could be friend or foe. Experience here can spell the difference. From the slippery chute to the stability of the road, it's a dash back into town where the cheers and encouragement of thousands of fans draws them towards the finish line. Strategy, strength, speed, and endurance, all will be needed to win this year's Mount Marathon. When we come back, We'll take a look at how the juniors fared, and can Carmen Young capture her third consecutive title? We'll find out. The strategy in all the divisions of this race is to be the first one to the hill, leaving your competition behind to struggle in the pack. And that's what Michael Graham did. Graham, a relative unknown, was in his fourth race, and while the crowd was looking at some of the favorites, Graham was setting his sights for the top of the mountain. Day and the rest of the ATVN sports crew. I'm Dan Debenham. So long, everybody. This ATVN sports special has been brought to you by the Alaska Vocational Technical Center. Train for a better job at Avtech. From forestry to fishing, welding to word processing, train with the best. Avtech.
This has been a special sports presentation of the Alaska Television Network.